All right, all right, folks. I'm gonna not. I'm not gonna make all-star teams yet. I probably will for the next uh, level here. The city of Xanadu, guarded by an overlord Highkosh, who's the highest-ranking general, and also the father of Ronnie. The end near scene 27. Very nice. And we get this cool music again. How about that? I love this song. Now. We actually don't want to take cities here. Wow, look at that. Uh, because uh, cities, when you take cities, it uh, makes people angry at you. So, jump shit, I'm sending him out. So, we're going to take one city, okay? We're going to take this one right here. That's going to be our base. And I'm going to send everybody on up. Now, I know I must send Ronnie. Money's not too much of a concern right now. And I think Debonair, too. Um, and of course, I replaced this dude with somebody different. So make sure we got our darkness units lined up. Uh, as well as our light units. But since we're not taking many cities, we can go ahead and be tough with who we're sending. So Yushis can come up. Shimura's good on snow. That'll be helpful. Uh, kinda, except she'll be out of step with everybody else. Uh, let's see. Slust? Oh yeah, he's a snow guy too. Snow problem. Ha 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 ha. Alright, old Warren. My man. up. Who else? We'll be needing Altesia this time. Fogel, he hasn't gotten a lot of action. Mm. I'm going to have Saradin stay back to guard the capital. Knockout blow, man. Oh, and Cannabis will be our other knockout man. <laughs> so there we go. Kept going straight offensive. We don't need to worry about taking cities or anything like that. That will actually be bad for us. Look at this. Look at this terrain, though. It's just horrible, isn't it? Now, I'm going to try it. These guys avoid getting in fights probably draw some combat so I don't want them to get into combat though I think it's the only level that's like this where uh, we'll actually uh, not want to take more cities although it's less important now because we our funding is pretty pretty straightforward now we don't have to worry too much okay what do we got here? No, oh, that's fine. You'll have to fight my unit here, I think. So yeah, my snow units. Or you could fight Saradin. No? Oh, okay, I don't care. Go fight Saradin. I'm gonna let you pass. What we got here? Dragon here with a couple of gold dragons. Damn. And what do you? Oh shit. I didn't look at the other guy. A couple of mages. Named Kimberly, huh? Said if you want to go fight Saradin, be my guest. Donate your body to science. 
So I'm gonna let these guys go past. These are my these are my anvils right here. Make sure nobody gets back. The key is just to keep driving. Oh, buried treasure. Big deal. Magic ring, good. I don't care. Yeah, there they come. There we go. And Yushi's met with an enemy. Unfortunately, it's the wrong time of day for Yushi's. But it's the right kind of terrain. Uh, yeah, well, let's try to take out those. Wow. Yeah, Jihad's pretty strong. We gotta try to take out those mages before they can do their thing. Yep. Let's see, will you also be successful? Yep. Good, alright. Well, that turned into a real nothing combat. Because these guys just can't hit my boy that hard. Um, yeah, Yushi's pretty good at what she does. And these guys have no hope of making it back, I don't think. Maybe they do. But if they do have hopes, we'll try to dash them. Well, pretty foolish of them to try that. <laughs> uh, but okay. Have at it, guys. Bam! I get a few hits here, but they can't do a whole hell of a lot of damage to the dragon there. I mean, they're, they're also kind of high alignment units. I mean, obviously we're not suited to be fighting at night, but neither are they, so kind of balances itself out and the fact that we got a real defense hog up front really Alright, and then came all the way down to fight Saradin, which uh, kind of a boo-boo there but have at it I thought I might replace the ninja here with, uh, what's his name, with, uh, what's the other thing we could replace him with? One of those, uh, sprites, one of those pixies I got, where I could turn into a self and then, uh, hit him with a white magic attack, so this unit would also have white magic attack, but I mean, come on, that's a little much. Not like it's too good, but what I mean is that, uh, you know, let's use the unit for what it's for. Oh, jump should met the enemy. Alright, well, we're gonna have to try to take out that dragon first. Ugh. And that's not gonna go well at all. Of course, it won't go that well for them either because their uh, light units are not. But they're good on the snow, as you can see. And, uh,. So they have an excellent chance of winning this fight against us for sure. So we don't have a fire weapon of some kind. Although we really didn't get particularly hurt. We didn't particularly hurt them either. Despite our overwhelming advantage in number of attacks. When you're doing one damage and nine damage, you can't expect to do that well. No, but apparently you can expect to win. Uh, I wouldn't want to keep fighting them though. Yeah, well, apparently that's exactly what you're going to need to do, Jamshid. Now, luckily, because we have uh, that monk there, these battles aren't very damaging. And also because they're high alignment units, they don't tend to do that much damage, although that was a pretty good hit. And we're missing a lot more than we should be. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we're going to win this one, because everybody else is missing. That's fine. Ouch. Yeah. No. But at least we didn't come out looking bad. So I don't mind that. Let's get John Ship popped to the back there. So he can come up and around. So we'll take this town. Pretty much have these guys squished in. Canopus can swing around here and make sure nobody gets to make it back for a recharge. Okay, well, Ronnie, there's a group you didn't want to fight at nighttime. Uh, so that'll work out pretty well. And now instead of that 
octopus who wouldn't do us a whole hell of a lot of good on this map we've got although maybe you know there's probably a lot of water strategies that you could put into effect in this game if you're really looking for it just because there's so many um, there's so many what's his names here you know rivers and, and, and things like that there's there's plenty of bodies of water that aren't just like water stages like we used them in the in the desert we used the water unit took us a while but yeah if you think about it that water could carry you all the way to the castle yeah well it's an idea anyway right all right let's keep driving there's no reason why we can't just push the push the hurt all the way on up all right well hopefully we'll be able to take out these mages here luckily they're just mages and they're not Ugh, we get to take two hits, which kind of sucks. Although it wasn't that bad, but wasn't that good either. Good, keep it moving. Yeah, running, just running right through. Should run through this one pretty easily too. The old ice giant here. Which uh, we had a couple of, but we uh, replaced. There we go. Wow, we got all right. Good, we got rid of the uh, cleric, and of course that makes it a lot easier. Shit, I should back you off a little bit, Ronnie. You're uh, maybe gonna tank my reputation. Yeah, give Fogel a chance to kill some things. Yushi's movement is finished moving. He's supposed to liberate the town, Yushi's. Yeah, it's in there. Now, this is one where we're not trying to kill everybody. We're just trying to outmaneuver them. And Ronnie's the unit that actually has to... Uh, Defeat our enemies here, or go face up with uh, the man. Ooh, debonair. That's not good. I want debonair to be fighting the, these guys. Look at this goofy unit here. Well, at least we got rid of the person who can't hurt us. Wow, jihad, but it missed everybody. That's good. And so they're pretty much, except for attacks by him, they're out of attack, so. It's gonna work real well. <laughs> it's weird that they got a cleric. Why wouldn't they have a monk at this point? I mean. Or not a. Yeah, a cleric? Yeah. Or at least a shaman, right? That doesn't make any sense. Well, it doesn't matter. There we go. Oh, they still cheer, though. Son! Oh, it's gonna help. Uh, yes. Yeah, let's throw away a card. Tower, we got too many of them. Oh, invaders, get out of the highlands! Yeah, that's the thing. Here, we're not liberators, we're invaders. Which I think is pretty interesting. But, uh, well. I had to take it all the way to its logical conclusion, guys. And these guys are not easy to go. Oh, well, forget it. We killed them in two hits. I didn't expect that. We're going to get acid attacked, but luckily it wasn't too bad. And since we get three attacks, it's going to work out a lot better. But we're still going to get acid attacked again, which is still not too bad. Yeah, Debonair is really, really good when it comes to... Uh, not getting hit with magic. So yeah, this is working pretty well. And this should be very quick. Although we're going to get jihaded, which is going to hurt. But not that bad. 
still, you know, worse than not getting jihaded, right? Here, kill the, uh, kill the strong one. Meh. Well, we're not gonna win that, but that's okay. Well, we're gonna win it, but we're not gonna... Oh, yeah, we are. Forget it. I misspoke. By we're not gonna win that, I meant we're definitely gonna win that. What do they got here? They got most of their guys are good guys too. Okay, let's just keep it moving. I want to get Johnson in the fight there, but yeah, who cares? I'm trying to get around for sneaky ass. Lust, you wanna go do some fighting? I haven't had let you out of the house in a while. So let's have him do it. Now in this case we'd better be careful because we can't uh we we are not able to uh what's the word for it? I don't remember. We won't be able to eliminate him anyway. But we can certainly kill a great deal of them. Now how did a place like the Highlands become so developed to where it was able to take off, take off, take over like the rest of the uh, continent here? I don't know. Make a lot of sense to me. Alright, well this would be a hell of a fight right here. Um, they got a lot more attacks than us, although we do get two all attacks. Yeah, well, that wasn't so bad. Wow, they cannot do shit to uh, Debonair. Wow, he's uh, he's a quite the powerful guy. The only thing they got going for him is they got three strikes with the paladins, but the paladins don't seem to be able to do a whole hell of a lot for a party here. Which is nice, which is good news. Yeah, that's the whole thing. We'll throw our full brunt of force so we can get Ronnie in there to go confront their dad. Which, if you think about it, is kind of fucked up. I guess, you, you, I mean, it's supposed to be good, that, I guess, that you provide justice, but usually, uh, you know, when you do that, it's like somebody who murdered somebody. But having my, you know. I mean, and the thing is, like, nobody, like, freaking totally surrendered. Well, I guess Norn did. And nobody like surrender surrenders for the most part. Like Levelon, he was on the level, right? He was like, I'm, you know, gonna defend my country, but you know, no hard feelings, rebels or whatever. But you have to, he you have to kill him. You can't just accept his surrender unless he, was, well, maybe just bound and determined to fight to the death, I guess. But uh, so it's kind of stupid, I, in my opinion, since. You know, I mean, that's a pretty ancient way of doing things. Like, yeah, hey, it's, uh, we want to uh, kill everybody. He's going to get the recharge, most likely. Yeah, didn't he? Or is that what that bleeping means? Dick. Well, fine. We'll just keep driving up. i got to bring Glenn up here so he can play knockout artist. But basically, all I really want to do is get Ronnie's ass up there. So that she can do her thing. Or Debonair, I think either one is supposed to face off with the man. I don't know if that how much effect that really has. Warren finally gets to fight again. So good for them. I don't know if I can actually kill these guys. I should replace that mage with that lich. I guess I just didn't. Yeah, how about that? Man, you're losing your touch. Oh, okay, we got him anyway. Still almost losing your touch there, Warren. It's a hell of a name for, like, a wizard of any kind, but... Well, let's back Slust up a little so we actually can maneuver on these guys. Because if we don't, uh, then just we're going to beat them up, but then we won't get any kind of finishing clubbing blow. 
Alright, well, let's not do the Lido, let's do the strong ones. They are strong, though. Look at these guys. Almost 300 hit points on these worms. That's a lot. Luckily, it's not their prime time. They still hit pretty good. I mean, not against my, um... Dragoons, who, you know, dragoons are just, they're just damn near invincible anyway. They hit him pretty good, though, don't they? I get our units up there and then we can start maneuvering more. Uh, get rid of these uh, guys if you can. Yep. Goody goody. I did want to make sure that we didn't have to take two uh, all hits. One all hit is quite enough, thank you. That's, uh, and that's not too bad. That's easily recoverable. I think. The gold dragons. What about the platinum ones? Thought that was the next step up. Nah, maybe we'll never get there. We don't use the dragons that much anyway. I don't really care for them too much. Well, this party's fine, but... Right, Celestie's getting a lot of fighting. Are you guys coming along? Yeah, you guys are eventually. Eventually. That's good. Our reputation didn't suffer that much because we only took one town. So I guess the idea is that, you know... We would have to do uh, so much shitty stuff to settle these towns that uh, it would, of course, affect us. You know, we'd have to really crack down on these guys, and that would that would that would hurt our reputation, if not through actual bad things we did, but through the propaganda value, which, of course, the uh, the empire would uh, propagate. Right? I'm reading a lot into this, uh, but you know. You can only watch these guys fight so many times before you start having the wax philosophic. But well, good, we don't need to even need to knock out below those guys. Yeah. Are these those worms that I couldn't finish off? Nope. Oh boy. A couple of gold dragon with the dragon ear. And I say they're even hard to hit, even for uh my uh, dragon knight there, my dragoon. He's having a hell of a time with him. Luckily, any uh, damages. Yeah, see, look, I can barely do. I can barely hurt him. That's just how high alignment they are. Luckily, you know, they're not able to really damage me. I'm able to damage them uh, to an extent, to enough of an extent. Ronnie's finished moving. Oh, is Ronnie up here now? No. She's Louise Ronnie, come on. Did you get your ass up here? Glenn, I need you to start closing in a bit. Just in case people try to run away. And are you healing up, Canopus? I hope you are, you turd. fighting with you shoes now. Unfortunately these are all like good guy units, so that's uh, bad. But it's almost nighttime now, so that's good. Alright, get yeah, get the yeah, get the weak one. Last thing I wanna have to do is deal with uh Well that sucks. Yeah they still insist on putting these guys in the back even though that's like one of the worst uses for him. Let's see, can I turn him into Seraphim yet? Let's check it out. Yay, alright, triple jihad. Enjoy that shit. 
It's only one attack, but it's three all hits. Which is probably overkill. Actually, I don't think it'll do as much good in this fight because these gold dragons are probably highly resistant to white magic attacks, but let's check it out. Eh, not that resistant. Eh, but still somewhat resistant, mostly because, uh, you know, Yushi's is a special character, so her hits are going to be harder than most other people's hits. So definitely be one of my high alignment all-star teams. Maybe take a dragon out and put a, somebody else in there. I wonder if Canopus would be able to catch this guy before he gets back. But Canopus is definitely going to get a fight here instead of that. Which I didn't want. But we got it, so we might as well deal with it. Nice, wow. Ouch. Definitely that worm not too strong against uh, ice to 50 damage, which is a lot. He deals a lot. But uh, uh, I think we should win the fight. <coughs> oh man. Yeah, we won, but uh feel like we lost it. Oh, we use one revive. That's the first uh, item we've had to use so far. <laughs> the Highlanders. Uh -huh. But I think the next stage isn't like that. I think we can take towns as much as we want in the next one. Although we might not take as many towns as we usually would. Ah, shit. Alright. Take out the uh, weak one, which is a stupid golems. Which, for reasons I can't fathom are being used. Ah, well, I tell you what, I need to put up with a lot of with a lot of beating and did not go down. Oh, I wish he hadn't hit him though. Whatever, we're gonna take we're gonna take another splash here, which is unfortunate. Ow. And we might lose that one. Whoa. Yep. Okay, maybe we're gonna have to let that guy get back. Or not. Let's see how fast he moves. Alright, well Yushi's met with the enemy. Which that one's unfortunate because if, if we win we're just going to knock him right into Canopus. So Canopus is trying to do something different. Luckily these guys do not have high magic resistance. Like they have high physical resistance. But Dalmage still got a chance to rip us pretty good. Oh, come on. All right, good enough. I should move Yushi's back a little bit. I'm sorry, why are you taking so long, Ronnie? You're not, like, moving anywhere. Everybody else is having these, like, apocalyptic battles, and you're taking forever. Alright, well we better get rid of one of these wizards. It's kind of our usual strategy here. And we can, because damn, he's strong. And should be about it. We, we gotta get Ronnie up there. Ronnie's just taking too damn long. I should have put that damn vampire in our party, I guess. This party's not good at killing everyone. But it is good at regenerating itself before the next battle. Because it doesn't take a lot of damage and we got that monk. Alright. Yeah, Ronnie's still crossing the river here. So I hope we don't kill all the units before... Maybe that's what might happen. That wasn't my intention. My intention was to maneuver around and and defeat their uh, you know their main uh, their their uh, go ahead and attack the castle while the other units were kind of busy fighting us but that definitely did not happen we 
which is really too bad. Although, you know, could be worse. Could be a lot worse. Um, all right. Well, now it's not gonna work out. What do we got here? I could just leave him here and Alright. Jump shit, why don't you jump up front? You're a freaking hero, right? Yeah, don't let Celeste have all the fun here. Oh, make sure that guy takes out, yeah. You take him out? You yes, sure can. Alright, well, that's pretty much all we had to fear from that unit. Oh, these guys have high hit points. I mean, these Eagle Men have been, they've been juiced up pretty nicely. Although, I don't know how strange that is at this point. I mean, we won't be able to take them out, though, unfortunately. That's okay. One of our, one of our scavenger units can eat the rest of them up, I think. Oh, Lynn, you better hurry the hell up, though, if you're looking to do that action. Man, Debonair jumping to town. Fogel hasn't had any yet, either, so I kind of want Fogel to get in on it, even though his guys are set to fight at night, so... It's, you know, it's not as good, but it's okay. And Ronnie still struggles to... Oh, no, she's over the river now. All right, get your ass up here, Ronnie. You got to get up here. Maybe I should have left her as a octopus unit, you know what I mean? Like, okay, she could have swung around right into the castle. And yeah, nobody would have stopped there along the way. Well, it's too late for that bullshit. That was a good idea, though. Ah, Inuki missed, but that's okay. Save myself a little damage, actually. Now oh, we'll fight full strength party. We're we'll back off. <laughs> There we go. Oh, now time for Fogel to fight. And he should do just fine in this battle since there's no real test to it. Wow. That ice bolt actually got him pretty good. Yeah, these guys are pretty good. The uh, tie it's because they got the everybody attack in the back row. Like I said, it's kind of stupid with dragons, though, because once they get good, you want them in the back row, but it kind of defeats the purpose of what kind of character are, they are, since... Yeah, I'll let him go, I don't care. Well, I better move. Better move old Canopus. He's not meant to be doing too much sustained fighting. I just brought him up to be uh, Mr. Death Messenger. It's almost nighttime, which actually works for Ronnie. Alright, we shall. That'd be a tough one. Um, let's hit the weak one. The weakest one we have access to. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't know why that guy in the right. I must have given him a really good sword or something. Because he does just tons of damage to people. Uh, a lot more than the other Eagle Man, who's probably on about the same level. Wow. Should win, though. 
Yep. Good. There we go. Old jump shit's gonna mix it up now. Now it's daytime. Should do a little bit better, although it's almost night. Uh, this is kind of another daytime unit we're we're dealing with, but ow. For the weak one. Yeah, you're gonna I nuke him down. Please. Yep. Good. Oh, nice. Very well done, Ayanuki there. Yeah, I guess that's what they say when they say the uh, the the core of uh, the Empire's army is made up of samurais and paladins. Which, yeah. I think after this, though, we're, we're mostly going to start seeing dark units. Uh, as we get further away from like the Empire's regular army and the we get more into the Empire's like squad of death. <laughs> They're occult forces. They're demonic forces. Yeah. Let's put a little rear, rear security there, as you can see. Uh, Warren, and he probably won't have too many problems uh, disposing of uh, this party here, who is um, foolish enough to come at him. Oh, that could have been a lot. Oh, yeah, Ayanuki can work, though, because my guy is, well, it's the last thing he ever did. But he did weaken my mage. Not that it'll do them any good, because my mage will, will just go to the, uh, the town there and heal up. But, yeah, Warren hasn't been getting as much attention lately, because he's not, he's no longer, I should have kept, I guess I should have kept him with the, uh, the phantoms or the ghosts because he was a low sky at that point which made him you know very maneuverable which is of course a great advantage all right so we got half but actually it's twilight now so maybe this is the best time for my unit here go for the strong one please yeah we're not gonna oh that wasn't too bad though front row fights well at night well should fight well at night but didn't fight well at night All right, well, that's a good deal right there. All right, and John Shit's gonna stand up to some fighting. We're gonna be using him a bit more in the future, so that's one of the reasons I put him in here. Uh, yeah, hopefully don't use yeah use uh, use him the strong one. Yeah, there you go. We'll see if they try to Ayanuki my lord here. Uh, they do, uh, but it's not that effective against them, thankfully. It did a fair amount of damage, but uh, they, they start to spread it out now. Good. I wish he got three strikes. Uh, some of, some forms do get three strikes. Um, his Ayanuki form gets three strikes. Yeah. I mean, after after that, th you remember after that thunder stopped being like special, like everybody attack thunder stopped being special or even very effective. So when I decided I had to move him to the front row for his own good. For it, not for his own good, but for, for it to be fucking useful anyway. Alright, what do we got here? Um, let's heal uh, jump shit up just a hair. And we'll go back. We have to. We, I guess we don't have to. We can go back and liberate all these towns after this, but we don't liberate them before. Gosh dang it, I wish Ronnie didn't take so damn long. Because it's, it's basically just like we're. We might as well be fighting. You know what I mean? We might as well be fighting uh, uh, everybody anyway, you know, with the amount of time it's taking Ronnie to maneuver around. Well, let's see how this goes, because, like, that, you know, that Jihad did a fair amount of damage, as as he's wont to do, although he recovered very nicely. Uh, but this is about all they got, other than they got a few, you know, club swings from him, and they got the Ankh, which does very little. So I think, we'll, I think we'll come out ahead on this battle anyway. Good. So it's going to be hard forming those all-star teams. Because we've just got so many good dudes. It's hard to know, like, who to really, you know, who to cut.
cut and who to take. As you know, I've, I've, I've grown attached to these units. And now I'm going to break a lot of them up, you know. And, uh, and I got to know all their members. Uh, I know, it sounds weird. But, you know, it has been. It's 27 levels, right? So far, that's a lot. So, are you coming or what? Okay, you're moving, just... You're slow as shit. Great. Oh man, who we got coming here? Uh oh. Cannabis is best not to deal with that. I don't want to fight those guys. Not with them. Hell, actually, I don't. I don't even want jump shit fighting right now. Now that it's dark and scary outside. Debonair fighting. Debonair, you didn't heal yet? Fucking loser. Fogel, yeah, let's send Fogel out. He's all evil. Well, he's not all evil, but he's got a couple of evil dragons with him. Alright, uh. Make sure you're actually in the town, Debonair, because you do need to actually heal your ass up. Alright. Well, John should still gonna have to fight a little bit here. Yeah, we didn't even get through a day yet because we hit that, uh, that goofy, um, what's his name? Got that card there. Wow, well, we fight, we fighting pretty good at night, guys. Well, if he hits that Ayanuki, it'll kill him, so. You gonna do the, no, he's not gonna do the job for us. He's gonna, they're gonna miss both of them. Which I guess is good, because I don't want to take a damage from it, but. <laughs> Good. Excellent. Let's keep it moving. Keep it moving, kids. Okay, here comes Fogel. Fogel is going to give him some nightmare sauce. That's my hope, anyway. <laughs> yeah, he should do just fine here. Now, that's going to be effective a bit. But. Aw, oh, man. Evil Dead was not that effective, and that's that's disappointing. Highly disappointing. No, oh, wow. Their high amount of alignment at nighttime has helped them a lot. Helped them a lot. Helped them very much. Helped them a great deal. That sounds like shitty. You know, like shitty vocab there. Like, oh, it's helped them a lot. You know, like a lot. Okay, good. Everybody's kind of standing still. I like that. Just kind of hanging out. Nice. Just gonna give time for Ronnie to get her dumbass up there. Oh, we got another unit like this. I don't care for that. Oh, well, at least that was effective that time. <laughs> okay, well, I'd rather hit the strong guys. Sorry. Should have been more uh, exact in my guidance. Yeah, even though Fogel's cursed to look like a dragon, he's still, uh... This unit would like to reconstitute itself, which I can't allow them to do that. Debonair, you healed up yet? Almost. Well, it doesn't matter. I gotta get you in there. Go ahead. Where's, where's Debonair at? You take too long to heal, stupid. Maybe we'll even bring John shit up. Because <laughs> I don't know if we're actually going to be able to beat this guy in one go. I'd like to. We're warring up to kill some dudes, too. Alright, Fogel, we'll have at him. Alright, well. Probably going to get jihaded pretty quickly here. No? Yeah. Ow. That's okay. It's good. Take a little bit of damage, though. I can turn those guys into zombie drones, but yeah, I just don't see the point because the time it gets the all hit in the back, which is awesome. You know what I mean? And uh, 
Oh, well, my idea for Glenn to take the uh, get the knockout blow there was in if it just didn't work out that well. <laughs> there we go. Almost got it, guys. Key, you keep at it, kids. There you go. Good. <laughs> then again, the Evil Dead. It sometimes is good, sometimes it ain't. I don't need to heal him up yet. Ronnie, you almost ready. Really sucked it up getting up there, but that's okay. And yeah, they can go after Saradin if they want to. I invite them to try. It will most likely be a painful experience, of course. Nice. Well, they're just they're just out of their element. <laughs> Except for the dragon here, which the dragon here I think is usually lower aligned, but it doesn't really make a difference. There we go. Looks like our maneuver unit's finally up there. After a very long time. And Warren will get to knock these guys out. Not much they can do about that. Yeah, that magic is strong. You see they don't get a lot of hit points, so Warren's only at 159, which is not much for how highly leveled he is. I don't know what they're planning to do with these units here. Maybe they're confused because they don't have a lot of towns to go after. That's why they're not moving. I'm not sure. But in any case... The no, last thing I want is Glenn getting in a lot of fights. He's not made to sustain, as I have often said. And we're not gonna be able to kill these guys, I don't think, before they before they get us. I don't know how hard they'll actually be able to hit these guys, though. Ugh. Well, I know we can't hit them very hard. Phantom. Yeah, I was gonna say that's that's the one attack that wouldn't work against my dragons there there we go that's kind of what I wanted to do in the first place I didn't do it <laughs> probably got to heal these guys up in a minute here yeah, we can always take Fogel back to the back to the castle here Yushi's up for a little bit, even though this is not the proper time of day for her to fight, but I think almost everybody is not at the proper time of day to fight. Alright, well, old Glenn's gonna have a little fighting anyway. And hopefully we'll do alright, but I don't know about that. I don't know if we're gonna be able to do right on this one. Yeah, was it bad? Yeah. That was a winner, alright. I wish we had another all hit, like they do, but yeah, still pretty good. If we could take out that other bird, it wouldn't have been high sky anymore, but now they are. Oh, they're gonna go after Ronnie, which that's a fucking that's 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 not a that's not a sound strategy. You're already weak. I mean, I wouldn't try to go after Ronnie, especially not at night. Oh, that was quick. Quick, quick, quick. Bet a vampire didn't get a chance to heal himself at all. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is what it looks like when you just try to steamroll. Although it's still taking me. We're, just, we're about at the 50 minute mark right now. These skeletons are actually hitting like they mean it now. So they usually do not. 
good, but they still cost me my high sky status. Or not, I'm sorry, low sky status. Here's Ronnie finish moving. Alright, Ronnie, invest in that castle, girl. I guess still got a lot left in there? Doesn't seem like it. Bunch, bunch of muses. What else we got here? That's it. Just us three amigos here. <laughs> you know, I probably should go ahead and just, uh, Cannabis uh, back into the city here. And now we're pretty. Oh, geez. Well, this uh, could be a bad time for my uh, my lovely uh, Earth. Indeed, it is. Well, luckily, we got them uh, pretty dead before they were able to do too much more damage to us. But yeah, they definitely had the antidote for that type of unit. So we'll just go ahead and back up a bit. As there is, in fact, antidote for that type of unit. And they had it well in hand. Oh, well. That's okay. I think uh, Warren's probably done his good, and we don't need to spend money on another uh, whatever. Uh, any revivals there? Even though, like I said, it's not a big deal, money anymore. But uh, it's uh, it's not really necessary to spend. Well, this unit's great, but it ain't that great. In that, uh, you know. Jihad's not going to do too much good against these goody-goody units like that one. Oh, we're going to go try to take a town from old Sluss down there. Somehow I think Sluss can handle it. Yeah, let's take out the leader here if we can. Nope, sure can't. <laughs> let's see how good they... Thunder probably won't do much good at all against most of us here. Eh. Yeah, it didn't. Uh, but then again, we are not hitting worth a shit right now. And they get another uh, Thunder Thighs hit, so. Yeah, I don't know. They might win this one, because we're missing, like, every attack we do. Yep. Is there anybody left in this town? Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, Fogo, okay. I was like, jeez Louise, are we going to lose? I didn't really expect Sluss to lose there, but... Yeah, old, um, what's his name's on, uh, on an island there, as you can see. Ooh, shit, probably should have, uh, healed up my guys here. I thought they would be healed up by now. That's okay, it looks like they're gonna survive anyway. Oh, wow, I didn't hit anybody. And she's finished, so that puts us in very good shape to go ahead and finish this battle off. Provided he's on target, and he generally is. Yep. Good deal. Great job, guys. All right, looks like, looks like this one's all over by the shouting. Ronnie's uh, going to go ahead up and uh, get to moving on in. Do it at night while she's uh, still strong. And weak, yes. It's all weak. Because I want to make sure that the uh, the vampire is effective there. Good. Ah, that would have been nice had he. But unfortunately, he was not able to strike well. Vampire, you can heal yourself up a little bit again. That'd be nice. Good. Because he'd healed himself and then he got hurt again. Which, you know, not good. I want him to actually... I mean, we can heal him up, of course. We can heal him up. I know, I'm just... Nice. 
There goes Ronnie. She's almost there. I don't know. She's probably going to win against Dad. That's going to suck. She's going to knock back onto, like, the land. Which will make it difficult. What, what will it do? It'll suck anyway. Ah! Like, it'll, it'll make it difficult for a return engagement. Just want that return engagement to happen quickly. Oh, I found some boots. That's nice. I think we actually did drain what they had. <laughs> oh, crap. Well, that's not going to work to my advantage here. Because we're not going to hit very hard. And we healed way too early. Ugh. Yeah, we probably ended up killing all their units anyway. Which is not what I wanted to do. That was not uh, what I had uh, planned out in my mind. But uh, apparently Ronnie was moving a lot slower. It might be because she has a vampire. I think that actually slows you down that you have the vampire uh, when he's asleep. <laughs> and Which is, you know pretty easy to figure out why. This is not moving, you have to drag him along. Alright, there we go. Ronnie! That I will have to face you in battle. Father, put down your sword. The Empire is finished. You must have noticed the change. The Empress Endora, she's a blemish on the honor of the Highlands. Shut up! We are a noble family who have always been supported by her highness. I must protect her to the end. Why do you not understand this? But father, I... No. I understand you must follow the path you believe in. You need not make the same mistake. I fight for my queen for my own honor and pride. Now draw your sword, Ronnie. Show me the strength of a paladin. Oh. It's kind of fucked up. Like, why? You know what I mean? Like, why do that? Now, we're probably going to get our asses kicked pretty good here. Particularly because I was stupid and didn't heal my party. I wish you hadn't done that. Oh, well, it didn't work anyway. Ow. Actually, that wasn't that impressive. Should do a fair amount of damage, because these are all, like, not darkness characters. And I need to hit the leader, by the way. So we are a pretty devastating party. Yeah, wow. Like, he gets a nice graphic, though. Look at that. He looks freaking badass. But our party's, like, way badasser. Man, man, I think it'll work. Pretty close to victory there, though. Wow. Like, what, you get, like, five attacks right at the end? That's kind of bullshit. All right, can we finish? Can we go now? Yeah, that's a unique unit type. Ah, shit. Huh, it seems that your goal is you've cho chosen... That the gods have chosen you over the Empire. But even so, I cannot let you proceed further. The honor and pride of the Highlands. Come and taste the edge of my sword. Okay. Once again, I did not prudently heal up, but then again, it doesn't look like that's going to be a problem. Uh, but also, it doesn't look like we're actually going to be able to... Unless unless Ayanuki works. If Ayanuki works, then we'll be fine. Uh, but I don't think it will. Yep. Yeah. That's not going to work either. We heal or what? Man. Yeah, I just don't want my lord to die in this battle. Ah! Yeah, this is way shittier 
than uh, how he fought. For you. Just, just, just run away. No, no, don't run away. Yeah, actually, run away. No, no, I don't want to use that. Just run away. I don't, I don't want him to use uh, what's his name. I don't want him to use Ayanuki on my lord and end the freaking game. Yeah, Ronnie, you can get right the fuck back in there if you want. You know. Oh, great. Who am I fighting? Yeah, nothing to really be afraid of though. Yeah, it's kind of sad, but they like having that tragic hero, don't they? And by they, I mean uh, the Japanese. <laughs> uh, that's just kind of their thing, you know? I mean, I, we do it sometimes in America, but you know, the, the guy who, like, dies for the cause, even though the cause is dead wrong, but just follows through for honor's sake. I don't know. Is that noble or is that stupid? Or is that ignoble that you keep fighting for the wrong cause just out of honors like like he said you know I do so for my own pride and honor right let's see debonair do you have anything to say to the guy nope okay I thought debonair might have something to say uh no let's take out the leader oh I mean the leader I don't think this one's gonna work out that well either Unless we can get that Gale thing really working well. No. Yeah. I'd say at least we take out the front row, which is of limited usage. Alright. Ah! Could end of the battle right there if you'd done it right. Oh, maybe Debonair will be able to end the battle. Can you do that for us, Debonair? Yo! Oh, you dumb shit. Ah! Now we get to get hit like a bunch of times. Oh, good. Well. Hey, you want, yeah, I forgot. He does Ayanuki, so he actually kills himself right there. Oh, you don't want to say anything? Okay, whatever. We liberate Xanadu, and I'm happy. I didn't realize that was the name of a really crappy movie. End of an interesting poem, too. Pleasure Palace. Did Kublai Khan did a Pleasure Palace decree? It's only 56, because we didn't take any of the cities. Uh, but whatever, I didn't want to take any of the cities. So that's it. Uh, Zetegnia. And then there's one other, other than that. But let's see, can anybody change class to anything? I doubt it. There's many classes left to change to. Let's see, did I tank anybody's uh, alignment? No, I did not. Well. I don't know that yet. Uh, yeah, alignment's somewhat suffering for Debonair's charisma anyway. He's too fucking good for his own good. Not that party, let's see. Ronnie, I know damn well these guys ain't got no alignment to, to worry about. <laughs> Evil. That's charisma is like way down too. Uh... You jump shit. Yeah, I bet that was good for your alignment because we kept getting our asses kicked. Lord of the Paladin, huh? Damn. Looks pretty strong. Maybe I'm being stupid by having him in the back row. Well, you slust. You still got high alignment? Yep, still does. Although his charisma suffered a bit because he's too fucking strong. His didn't. Alright, well, good deal. I think that's, uh, that's that's probably enough. Oh, wow, his alignment went down. Oh, well, doesn't matter. Doesn't make any difference at all, because we are going to the last level, the second to last level soon. But first, I'm going to go back 
uh, and uh, liberate all those towns. But that's enough for today. And so I hope you uh, enjoyed the uh, that playthrough. And then we're going to have another magical playthrough. Two more. And uh, that'll be the game. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye. Alright, hello everyone. This might not be the most exciting video, but I'm trying to be, make this somewhat of a completionist deal. Somewhat of a completionist deal. And so I need to liberate all these damn towns, which is safe to do now that, uh, now that what? Uh, excuse me, now that we're, uh, we've already conquered. I don't know, there might be hidden temples or shit around here. Frankly, I don't care. Uh, we just need to get this done here and so I made a couple of uh, uh, units with only uh, the girls here the angels so we could do this quickly and efficiently that's the idea anyway and just to see what people say maybe you're curious I'm not that curious but maybe you are and I felt bad if I left it out of the game I was tempted just to advance right to the end. Yay! Liberation. I think that was placed right there so that you would instantly know that it's a bad idea to uh, liberate these towns. I guess. I don't know. I have betrayed the gods by following black magic. I have no right to call the monk. We will now begin to rebuild the Roshian temples. Well, I mean, other people didn't do that, so you don't really have to worry about rebuilding it. Whatever. It's nice we still get this cool music, though, huh? I guess I could use the speed button, huh? Alright, let's do that. There we go, the industrial city of Saba said, the whatever, I. Good card world, okay. Let's go ahead and keep that one. This blocks magic, it acts like wall does. Well, not exactly wall, because it doesn't, uh, uh, what's his name, uh, bounce off, but then reflect. I heard the paladins were executed by Prince Garrus in Zetegnia. What could be happening in Zetegnia? I'll tell you. Probably a lot, because the, the whole place is collapsing, so. I gotta imagine that, uh, all kinds of crazy shit's going on. And we, apparently we haven't killed old Prince Garrus yet. So, hopefully we'll get to finish the job. Ah, Magician. Everybody's intelligence goes up. Unfortunately, we have very few units that are actually deployed right now. I heard the Paladins. Okay, he said the same thing. Fine and dandy. Alright, why don't you go up to the next town on the hit list there, Jump Sheet. And after this, I'm going to do some radical reconstruction of my guys here. Not to be confused with radical reconstruction following the Civil War. Which I don't know why it would confuse those two. Star cards! Everybody likes a little more speed. Alright, what do we got here? No, I don't want to keep it though. Uh, just as you say, Empress Endora is different than she used to be. Maybe the black magic. Yeah, the black magic can have a negative effect on your personality. I've heard that. I read that in uh, Red Book Magazine. Just kidding, I didn't. Well, I mean, obviously, I'm just kidding. Ah, Pila Scafia. Pila Scalfia. It's like Philadelphia, huh? Except written really stupidly. I'm just doing this because we might get something from all this. No? Just a little reputation, which we don't need. Fine. I heard the paladin. Yeah, okay. I can't believe that a man as kind as Prince Garrus could have done something like that. Yeah, yeah, we've uh, known him to be a real softy. Let's buy some shit. What the hell's Folio do? Oh. Records in the midst of the gods. Well, I'm pretty sure we don't need that. Let's just make sure we got enough of all this. Regular heals. Got 20 of these. Because we're going to be going for it. I mean, we're going to actually try. We're going to fight the next one like an actual battle. Like you'd want to fight. Like you try to outmaneuver people and get to places of advantage. I'm not going to be trying to take cities and stuff like that like I've done in the last ones. Although I probably will have one unit. Maybe I'll keep Altissia's unit just so she can go take cities. 
Just to, you know, so we get enough money at the end. Cause we gotta worry about that cash. Yay, alignment goes up for everybody. Shouldn't need it because everybody's already as high as they go. Well, I guess Garrus is a a real sweetheart. Okay, everybody's still moving. Very good. Keep moving, boys and girls. The trade city of Ubla, whatever. The fool card. Love the fool card, but we got too many of them already. So no thanks. I heard that, yeah, okay. Paladins were warriors who always guarded the end of the highlands. What could have happened? I don't know, but you start asking a lot about it a lot. Well, buried treasure, which we most likely don't really need. But it's fine, whatever. Ice charm, yay! Who cares? I guess it would have been nice in this level. Although I probably wouldn't even have equipped it. Shrine City! Yeah, we're getting all good cards at least, I'll say that. I heard the pallet, yeah, we heard. What could be happening? I don't know, dude, but you, sh you sure can't get over it. These people of uh, the city of Xanadu. Like I said, ah, Palakot. This is more for your benefit, guys, so that you can see what people say after you liberate the town. It's kind of for my benefit, too, because I'd actually like to see what it is as well. Uh, yeah, okay. Jeez Louise. I wonder if there's a hidden temple or town up here. Let's check it out. I'm sad that Ronnie killed her own pops. I mean, how's that to have on your conscience? Probably not so great, huh? Of course, Ronnie's pretty evil now. I mean, she's not supposed to be, but I used her way too much, and uh, yeah, now she's now she's quite evil. Are right, the paladins? Yeah, okay. Yeah, all right, got it, got it. Executed all the paladins. Actually, that could be a good clue that we're going to see only dark units on the next level. Could be. Now, Blanche didn't find anything. Which is a hilarious name for an angel. It's a hilarious name for a woman in general, I think. My apologies to those named Blanche. It makes it sound like a waitress at a Greasy Spoon type restaurant. Maybe that's not fair to say. Ben K. Yeah, I'm gonna severely cut the number of units I have down. <laughs> We're just gonna go with however many I can deploy, which I think is nine. And it's really stupid that I don't know that. This is off the top of my head because... All right. Walled city of Ludan. We're almost done. God dang, there's a lot of cities on this one. Be enough to tank your rep. Strength. Which, not surprisingly, brings up your strength. Oh, yes, yes. What could be happening indeed? I don't know. But I'm sure if you keep asking that, somebody will answer you. Not gonna be me. Let's hurry up before we have to pay taxes. Hard to paladin. Oh, jeez. Before now, the Empress and the Prince would never have done anything like that. I guess that Black Magnus is as evil as they say. I guess so, man. I guess so. Yep. Empress. Not that Empress. The Empress is flipping us off, by the way. Charisma up. That's nice. Uh, what could be happening? I don't know. Finally, the Roshian Temple. And that's enough. And I'll reform my units, and then we're going to have a good old time. World card. I'll take, uh, yeah, another one would be good. Uh, what this? No, sun's a good one. How about uh, death? We never use that one. All right. I betrayed the gods. Oh, jeez Louise. All right. All right, that's enough, guys. Uh, thanks for watching my video. And uh, we'll be back and I'll show you my crazy things I did to my uh, unit roster. See you later. Bye-bye.